Mercado Vial TV, un mundo de máquinas. Biscayne Servicios. Yeah, we are in uh, another day of Conexpo 2017. We are in the Liu Gong booth, in the stand, and with a really new thing, we have never seen that. So this is our new vertical lift wheel loader. And so what that means is the loader arm, like skid steer loaders, has a vertical lift path. Conventional machines, which we call radial, move the arm in a circular path. So the vertical lift wheel loader brings the arm straight up. That allows us to put in a larger payload, which means a larger bucket, and also have higher dump height and higher dump reach. So the old machines, the arm had no elbow, and so it would lift the load straight up like this. And the disadvantage is, at this point, the stability is not very good, it's not very strong. And at the highest height, if you want to go higher, it moves back over top of yourself. But with our vertical lifter, we've built in an elbow. And so the arm moves straight up. We're stronger and more stable in the middle. And at the highest height, we can reach higher and reach further. The elbow is right there between this gray link in the back and the yellow arm up front. Yeah, and you have to put this new uh, stabilization uh, links. I don't know how to call it. Yeah, what you would call it is a four bar linkage. And that means that there's four separate parts that are moving together to give it that vertical lift path. It is a purely mechanical system. So no electronics, no additional hydraulic valves. So that means that it's very, very simple and it's also cheaper to manufacture. For service, the vertical lift loader has fewer pins, fewer links and fewer cylinders than the tool carrier radial machines. So it's that's something the customers already accept today and is very common in the marketplace and we're actually more simple than that. If we have the same wheel loader, the, the conventional one and this one, uh, what's, what are the differences I mean in the bucket? There's two ways to think about the advantage. One way is if you have a radial and a vertical lift machine with the same size bucket. For that comparison, the vertical lift machine will have a much smaller operating weight. That means it'll be a lower price and the per hour cost to operate it will be lower. The other way to think about it is if you have two machines with the same operating weight, the vertical lift machine will have a 30% bigger bucket, will be able to reach the bucket two feet higher in the air and have one foot forward reach greater than the radial machine. For the operator, it works exactly the same. There is no additional controls, and the behavior of the bucket, the path that the bucket levels as it goes up, is exactly the same as a Z-bar radial lift machine. So for the operator, he just does everything exactly the same. The only difference for him is, his machine has a bigger bucket. When you are unloading in a in a truck, you you have the you have to check the same distance that you have early. I mean, or you are like more near to the the machine, the the, the truck and the machine are all together. No, we're actually further away from the truck. So that means that you're not as close to the truck. It reduces the chance of having any damage to the truck. It makes it easier for the operator and safer for the truck and the machine. Okay, with all these advantages, when will we have this in the market? I mean. The end of 2017, it will be available to our customers. Uh, all the line of uh, wheel loaders, or will you will start with this size? We're starting with this size here, the VL80. This will be our first machine. In the future, we'll be building smaller models and larger models until we have a full range from smallest to largest of vertical lift loaders. In percentage, I mean, the, the price between a common one and this one, is uh, this is expensive? Or, uh, It's not so expensive. It'll be a small cost change because the only difference is steel mechanical linkages at the front of the machine. The percentage, we're still setting the parts, but it for sure won't cost twice as much. It'll be maybe something like 30% more. Congratulations again for this new feature. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. ¿Qué estás esperando? Suscríbete ya.
Mercado Vial TV, un mundo de máquinas.